Hi there, it's Tanya from Tatter Treasures. Hello and welcome back. Um, just putting the light on, it was a little bit dark. Um, so this is another one out of the snippets, straight clusters, um, what we're doing this weekend. And I wanted to use some of these tickets what the lovely Helena sent me. Um, she sent me them through my ooh, Amazon wish list. So I'll just give you a quick look in case you've not seen them before. So I don't know how many pages. 104 tickets all together. So <coughs> it does repeat itself. So I think there's, I don't know if there's four or there's five different pages. Hold on. Six different pages. I don't know. I think they all might be different. Yeah, you're different. Ish. Anyway, so that's those. So I thought I would <coughs> use some of those up. Um, and yeah, <laughs> I've kind of I've got a an idea, but I've not got a plan. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start by taking some of the tickets off I think I'd like the more neutral um, ones I oh, love this the brilliant card so we'll have... I think I got oh, I think I got ten mushrooms out so I want ten tickets these probably reddish ones will be quite nice so that's three, four, five, I'll take that one, <clears throat> six, seven, eight, And I've got some mushrooms and these are from um, the Artemis mushroom and fern kit and I think if I remember right cause these are from what's left over from last um, autumn when I did the woodland series I think I did these two to a page but they could be four to a page they might be four actually um, so I've got some mushrooms. I am going to give everything just a quick, quick inking over. Now I did re-ink this the other day. That's just that's not too bad. I just didn't want it to splodge all over um, the mushrooms. Is this the one I re-inked? Yeah. I expected it to be a bit more juicy than that. So we'll go around these, the tickets won't want to run. What's that? Yeah, so in the kit you just get, it's just one sheet, but um, yeah, they're very, very nice mushrooms. <laughs> I'd probably say they're about, I don't know, inch and a half kind of height. What's that? I should have done this bit before, but <coughs> I got um, semi prepared. Okay, that's that. Nearly there, nearly there. So I hope everybody's doing okay. Um, I'm filming this. I think I'm only oh, about a week in front with filming. Um, I'm not as in front as, as I was. Because, um, yeah, things have been uh, busy and things. Um, 
I say, yeah, I'm not as in, in front now, which I'm not keen on. <laughs> it's all right to keep, um, you know, up to date with, like, relevant what's going off this week type thing. But, um, yeah, it, it's no good for, all, you know, if you're poorly or if you're doing something or whatever, that you've got that, um, you know, so many videos there. Just... Um, inking the tops and the bottoms as you can you've probably worked tight probably didn't need being told that so i think first i'm going to match match the mushroom with, with a ticket let's just put that over there and i'm going to pop them together with art glitter so i think i will probably want them i probably want the number at the top I think I, I like it like that. That one probably wants going and that way. <coughs> so I'm thinking the red ones probably won't go with the browns. So let's pull some um, browns out. I've got any more reddish ones. That's like a pinky reddish. Um, another brown one. So that's that, they look fine. Um, is that a little bit pinky? They're all a little bit pinky. They, a lot of them are more like a nude um, colour, which I really do like. So that's probably pinky. Not keen on that one there. Don't want that one there either. Let's go for that tall one. Yeah, that's probably fine. I'll do some on the other side, Tanya. <laughs> oh, yes. So I think I'm going to have that outside. This is a more pinky one. That, that side. Oh, that's upside down. Silly Billy. Kind of that, that side. I think I could do with a shorter one for that one. Maybe that one. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. That can go on there. Do it that side. I don't want for this one. Yeah, I like that one. That's two. Maybe that'll be. Okay, so I'm going to glue them down. Yep. So. Yep. So. So as I'm filming this, it's Friday. Um, I'm not at work this week. Um, I took some some time off, um, but I'm hoping to go back next Friday. Um, I, ha I have now given up my Wednesdays. Um, I have been struggling, um, especially now. You know, I've been having the grandchildren every other weekend. Uh, plus work, um, you know, both Etsy shops, YouTube, home, um, 
and things so yeah it was i was managing but it it was i was beginning to struggle um so the wednesday is the smaller shift so it's obviously losing less um money than giving the friday up so yeah just be working the fridays now so hopefully I'll be able to just get into, well, be getting into another new routine. It's, um, yeah, when I say I was starting to get too sapped um, with energy. And the thing is, um, you know, I started the YouTube and the Etsy shops with a view to one day working from home. So, um, you know, I didn't want to cut down the amount I was doing um, on YouTube and, and Etsy because, you know, that for me, that's not moving moving forward with um, long-term term goals type thing. So I have got some um, offcuts. Now, what I'm thinking is, let's just pick a couple of decent ones. That's got a lovely um, mottled effect from... Um, tear stain then and put um, one of those plastic doilers down I think I want some some thicker ones oops that's far too many Tanya right let's go I don't know let's have a lot so I was thinking I think we have to go like let's just do this sample one i'm gonna have to rip the top off i can't um do a straight edge i don't mind a straight edge on the bottom right let's have a look at that so if that was like so Then I was thinking I've got all different like tissues. Um thinking of maybe a little bit of a, a collage type um thing. Like so. Pop that there. Pop that there. And that there. Yeah, I like that. I think these would want seven. And I feel like it probably needs something else um, at the back of it. So let me just put that to one side a second. Um, as you see, I've got um, my uh, distress sprays. Uh, these are the only two, I, two I've got. And I think it's the only two. Two or one. Maybe I'd like a, a darker green. But... Um, and I don't know a different brown but um, yeah I'm not gonna want loads of them so I've just got this cereal box and I'm thinking just put that there uh, to protect everything in the background so let's not use the nice paper just in case it it looks um, well just in case it doesn't look um, right, so I'm thinking, oh, let's just keep spraying on the wire since I've used them. So it's, are you supposed to keep doing it until there's nothing left at the bottom? No, that can't be right. I think 
looks okay. So I'm thinking, oh, oh gosh, what's that? Yeah, you need to be quite far away, don't you? Which is like quite difficult when, when you at your desk. Do that thing. See how they do this crafty Ollie creates. Oh yeah, I like that. I think I did this on my um when I did the uh folio with the um oh, what's it called? Uh, that delta paper. Um I think I probably put too much brown on that one, but If it's still I don't know, it dries pretty quick. It's probably not dry to actually use it, but I like that. Okay, I'm just going to put those over there um, just to um, dry off a little bit. Let's put that there. Right, so we've got this one. So I'm going to ink this back part. And I'm going to just put some glue down here just to catch this tissue. This is the lovely tissue that Carrie sent me. So that's that. And then this burlap one, um, Jean at Inkhouse Studio sent me that one. So I'll do that. And there's no mushroom can. I'll do that. We're feeling it needs some green in or I am thinking of probably saving these um till I do woodland things anyway, so I don't think I'm that bothered about um green as such so let's have a look um what these did look like on on different things so if we had it say as as page decoration you know just just across the bottom of your page yeah that would be nice Yeah, I think I need to, if I could take that off. I think I need to, like, have it more, like, say. So, yeah, I like that. So I'm going to stick that down. So, yeah, you'd have it across there if you wanted to use that bit as as a little bit of a um tuck obviously you won't put anything as big as that on you probably need to just put some card underneath it and uh cut around it or you could hmm. i don't know let me just have a look in my um Why can't I find something when I want something? Right, let's 
So let's say this was like a corner pocket, like so, and then that could go on there. And obviously you could you could tear that. So let's so that's like a bit a good ink. I would probably then stamp or stencil um there. So you could attach that like so and then you've got that uh, to push it in. So yeah, I like that. Um got some pieces somewhere here. Yeah. So like if you was doing a postcard that would look nice. If you wanted it to the edge obviously you could just tear that part off. So that's that. Index card, yeah. Number two bag for a big, big bag for a big <laughs> big for a bag. Little envelope, I <laughs> like that. And then a little vaccine envelope. So yeah, we'll go with that. Oh, I've got an, um, a roller dance card. So perfect. Okay, so that's what we're gonna make. <laughs> gonna say I did. You know, I had the idea in me, and I just, um, I'll keep that in there. It might be a good, a good reference. Oh, look at this. Oh, you know where that's going, don't you? <laughs> in my to-do pile. To-do. Right, let's um, put that back. Come on, let's get on with this now. Um, right, what am I doing? Let's bring us things back. Okay. I'm guessing this is going to be um, dry. So, let's rip along here. Okay, let's ink. Um, if you don't have sprays, obviously you could just stamp or um, stencil. So yeah, these are proper stuck on now, so I'm not going to be able to do it. Yeah, so I'll have to go a bit straight. Um, I must do do things on a wonk instead of straight. Right, so I'll use this bit. So let's um might as well carry on using this back. Yep. So you know what? I'm gonna use um glue stack. Let's get me book out. Right. Oh, sorry if it's a bit, um, you know, funny. But, um, yeah, like I said, I, I just didn't have time to actually um, try it out. I was just thinking, oh, what can I do with those tickets? Um, and that was as far as I kind of kind of got. So that's that. Let's um, put that on there, like so. And that can go there. I think it needs a bit of something else. But a bit of, yeah, a bit of doily behind it. Well, that might work nice. Yeah, I like that. So I'm going to pop that there. So I'll 
Okay, right. I'm just going to pause because I think Ryan's just back from, from work. Well, I will if I... If I yeah, I'll see you in the tag. So, that's that one. And we'll carry on with this one. So, let's take that. Pop that there. Oops. That's why I do it on there. So, that can go there. Let's just stick that down. Okay. I've got a bit of uh, green decorator's paper here. So, I'm going to pop that there. So I've just got the smallest amount of different tissues. I've got some decorator's paper, um, some tea bags, um, some natural coloured tissue paper, a little bit of green vellum, uh, some brown packaging paper, more tea bag in different colour, um, and a doily, and that, and that little bit of burlap and the little bit of tissue. Um, from Kerry, so I've only got all little little bits out, so I'm going to pop that there. They so can hardly see um, what's been sprayed anyway, but um, it's it's nice and to just have that something right. So no, I'm not keen on the red one with the green. Let's go for this one. Yeah, I like that one. So I'm going to put that there. It's probably a little bit too long, but I'm going to keep it long. Yeah, because it can always be cut down, ripped down as, as you use it. So I pop that there. Like so. We just ripped my bit of tissue. That's it. So that's another one. Oh, I love that. Right, that's um this one should be dry because again that, that didn't have much much on. I try and not take a lot off this top so we can have it <laughs> just a bit a bit wider. I think I did something very similar <coughs> um, in the Woodland series. Um, I do have it in a playlist, all the Woodland things that, that I did. If you're starting to think about, <coughs> um, you know, autumn and fall. Right, we'll use this bit of tissue. I think that's the, the last bit. I think I've got another square in, in my tissue bag. So that can go there. Let's use that up. So we'll put that along that, like so. Gosh, I'm stuck. <laughs> pop that there. Then we'll pop that there. Like so. Um, should use a little bit of this crunchy tea bag. And do that there. Okay, so that can go there, probably rip it about there. Now you could do these like the snippet um, roll, you know, continuous paper and then just put um, things like this and then rip it down um, as you want it. So that's that one. Okay. So, and I can always add 
um, you know, a ticket or they're not, you know, well, obviously it's not glued down yet, but I don't think it would take a lot to, you know, poke something um, in the side of it if you wanted to, to carry it carry it on. So I've got this left. Let's pick, let's do a red one. So I think I want to go quite brown. So I'm going to put that on there. Like so. Okay, that might be. Yep, that will do that one. That's that one. That's the one that's on my tip. You can see that it's wanting to burst off. Right. So that's that one. So um, we've got this half one here. That's... Okay. Which one am I going for? Yeah, let's go for a smaller one. I quite like that. That's... Yeah, I'm going to do that there. Way on Thursday. I think I'll have a cup of tea after I've done this. Right. So that can go in there. Then I can't, oh no, I want to put something on it. I wonder if just a, just a wisp through the middle. So it all dry separately because they're quite quite sticky. Right, let's have a look at this one. I think we've just got, got enough of these strips. Can't I spray them? It's quite soft this paper because it is it's not wet on top, but it's still still wet in the middle. Right. Got a nice long strip. Um can so this on and then I'm gonna scrunch it up. Okay. That's not what colour we're going to add. Let's have a red one so we can do with something. Yeah, I've got any more of that really dark tea bag. I thought I had. Hmm. I don't think that's going to do much good to you. <laughs> oh dear. Right, let's go for a, um, a bit of packaging. I 
haven't run that back down in that too, though I have. Yeah, I quite like that, just, um, that's, see if I can get that bit, I don't know if it'll stick, um, that bit, Yeah, there we go. Right, three left. So I've got that one. Oh, you know what? I've not done any on this side of that one. How terrible. need something chocolate brown. Have I got it on the floor? I thought you're going, no, you've used it. Can't you remember? <laughs> no. Hmm. No, I don't want green. So, no. Right, I'm going to leave it as, as it is, but I do think that it does need something chocolate brown. But that's not to say that I can't add just a scrap of chocolate brown paper in as I use it. So that's that one. Two more. Oh, so let's be careful with this and then that will that'll do us. Use that bit. Use that. Um, I think I'm going to put that in my. Yeah, okay, that way. Like so. So, here. Glue stick or stick this fallen down, but we shall see. We can go that. That's it here, so that's far too wide. Um, on that there. No, so I'm not using that. Let's put some brown paper on it. So I'll run that through the middle and then that should should do it. So I'll put that. Let's do it a bit thinner. So I've just finish that one 
and I'm just about to finish this one off. I thought this looked a bit plain, um, and then once I put that on, it was too white, so I'm going to put that at the back of it, and that'll finish those off. Um, I have got a snippet roll, again, on the Woodland um, playlist, if you're interested in that. Did I not stick that on? I don't think I did, did I? Yep. I'm going to put that in there. Let's just see if there's enough ink on here just to. That's it. And that's that one. So, I'm very happy with those. So, thank you very much to Helena for sending me those lovely tickets. Um, I shall look forward to, to using them, them again. It's a very, very nice card. And it saves cutting, cutting them out. Uh, so, that's, that's those. So, thanks for joining me. And I shall see you later with probably another cluster snippet kind of thing. Bye for now.